We've just finished this fleet of cars and now we're off to the next customer. Let's make our way there now. Today, you'll find out exactly how millionaires keep their cars so clean. Stay tuned as the second car will be one of the most beautiful supercars I've ever worked on. So chaps, I used to think that there was barely any wealthy people in the world. But when I got into the car cleaning business, I realized just how many there are. But not only that, they all seem to know each other. So once I got my first supercar client, the word quickly spread. And my clientele grew to what it is today, as more and more people were satisfied with the work that we do. We've just arrived. Look at the state of this Porsche 911 GT3. It is in for full decontamination both inside and out. My brushes will fit everywhere and clean everything off this carbon forged wheel. Time for the snow foam. This green stuff will remove the first layer of contamination. So chaps, John in the comments below told us to use two colored snow foams on top of each other on the car to see how it looks. So check it out. Look at that combination, looks amazing. I let the beautiful snow foam sit on this Porsche and loosen up all of that traffic film. Time to pressure wash this work of art. If you enjoyed this, give this video a like and definitely subscribe. Comment below on what you want to see on our channel and we'll try and make that happen. Let's perform a hand wash using a special shampoo and wash mitts to safely pull that dirt out of the paintwork.
the blue wash mitt is designated to clean the lower sections. We now use the clay towel to take any embedded contaminants out of the paintwork. This will allow the Porsche to have a really bright and clear finish. Head on over to tinocorecare.com for the most advanced and high-tech products. Time to clean up the gloss and then the door jams. This bonnet is extremely lightweight. We can't forget about the carpets. They were the dirtiest part of the car. So we will vacuum them and deep clean them afterwards. The drill brush is a game changer. It makes things a lot quicker. Back in the day, we used to do everything by hand. The remaining GT3 interior services are also brought back to life. Time to apply a final shine and protection to this core before dressing the tires. And here are your results. Enjoy! Remarkable! This Porsche is back to a brand new condition. But let's not waste any time as we have another insane supercar waiting for us. What do you guys think of London and would you want to live here?
This is a bespoke Ferrari 488 pistol in for a exterior clean. The gold wheels that match the stripes on this car are cleaned first. Not an inch is missed, everything must be done to perfection or else we are in the wrong business. Time for the green snow form. That looks spectacular. Let's now rinse off the shampoo. Let me know in the comments below which car and coloured snow forms you'd like to see next. Time to hand wash the pistol. Top to bottom, straight lines and multiple clean mitts. These are the main things you need to keep in mind when performing a hand wash. Time to use a Tino detailing brush to safely wash the nooks and crannies of this supercar. Which car would you prefer to own? This Ferrari or the Porsche we did earlier? This is a tough one. I now completely dried Ferrari Pista. We now begin to wipe down the door shots along with the beautiful engine.
final check is performed using the exterior detailer. The tire shunt completes the final detail of the day. Now check out these remarkable results. Have you honestly ever seen a car shine like this before? Amazing! 